Hello students, welcome back. This is video number 3. Topic is group 13, boron group elements. The first member of 13th group is boron. So it is called boron group elements. And that group is highlighted by red color. Now we will discuss about boron and its important pores. The symbol of boron is B. First you should know what is the meaning of ores. Ore is naturally occurring rock that contains desirable minerals. That means the ore contains the highest percentage of that particular mineral. The first ore is borax. The formula is Na2B4O5 OH4 times 8 H2O. The second ore is kernite. The formula is Na2B4O5 OH4 times 2 H2O. The second member of boron family is aluminium. The symbol is Al. The important ore is bauxite. The formula is Al2O3 to H2O. Other elements gallium, indium and they occurs in their sulphides. Now we are going to see the chemical properties of boron. In boron family, boron is the only non-metal and boron is less reactive. Boron shows reactivity only at higher temperature. Formation of metal borides. Except alkali metals, all other metals react with boron. It forms metal borides. The general formula is MXBY. Here X is ranging from 0 to 11 and Y is ranging from 0 to 66. Now the direct combination of metals with boron. The example is when chromium reacts with boron at 1500 Kelvin it forms chromium boride. Second reaction is reduction of boron trihalides BZL3 plus tungsten at 150 uh, sorry, 1500 Kelvin uh, in the presence of dihydrogen it forms tungsten boride. So this is the reaction for boron. Boron combines with halogen to form boron trihalides at high temperature. See the example, when boron react with halogens, X means halogens, it forms boron trihalides. Next reaction of boron is formation of boron nitride. When boron burns with dinitrogen at high temperatures to form boron nitride. See the example when boron combines with reaction of boron is it produces formation of boron oxides nitride. that means boron oxides when boron is heated with oxygen around 900 kelvin it forms its oxides see the reaction boron plus oxygen at 900 kelvin it is giving boron oxide next reaction of boron is reaction with acids and alkali you know very well about acids and alkali Halo acids have no reaction with boron. It means halo acids means hydrochloric acid, hydrofluoric uh, acid like that acids. However, it reacts with sulfuric acid and nitric acids. It forms boric acids. So it can react only with sulfuric acid and nitric acids. See the reactions. Boron plus sulfuric acid H2SO4 means sulfuric acid. It is giving boric acid H3 BO3 plus uh, sulfur dioxide. Next, boron reacts with sodium hydroxide, it forms sodium borate. See the equation boron plus sodium hydroxide, that means NaOH, it is giving sodium borate, Na3BO3 plus H2. Now we are going to see some uses of boron. The first uses of boron is 
it has the capacity to absorb neutrons so it is used as moderator in nuclear reactors second use amorphous boron is used as a rocket fuel igniter igniter means it can make fire boron is essential for the cell walls of the plants so each and every cell wall it contains boron and the third sorry fourth uses is compounds of boron have many applications for example eye drops antiseptics washing powders etc contains boric acid and borax you can see here some pictures by seeing the pictures you can understand antiseptic eye drops and washing powders you can see then next important use is in the manufacture of pyrex glass boric oxide is used so this is one of the example of a pyrex glass see if boron is absent that means deficiency of boron in leaves what happens you can see then uh, how boron is used in the rocket fuel and how borons is used in a nuclear reactor Now we are going to discuss about some properties of borax. It reacts with acids to form sparingly soluble boric acids. See the reaction Na2B4O7 that is borax reacts with HCl and H2SO4. It forms sparingly soluble boric acid. Second reaction is when treated with ammonium chloride it forms boron nitride. See the reaction Na2B4O7 plus NH4Cl that is ammonium chloride it forms NaCl plus boron nitride. Next uses of borax. First uses of borax is uh, for the identification of colored metal ions. Second use is uh, for the manufacture of optical and uh, enamels and glasses. It is also used as flux in metallurgy and also acts as good preservative. And that next one is boric acid. Before go to boric acid, you can see some images you can understand the uses of borax first one is identification of colored ions Second the formula of boric acid is h3bo3 or how borax B used OH as a preservative in food now the preparation so now we are going to boric see acid can borax be extracted acid. from borax and colmonite see the reaction na2b4o7 plus h2so4 plus h2o we are getting na2so4 plus h3bo3 that is boric acid Second, is, second one is colmonite that is Ca2B6O11 plus 11H2O plus sulfur dioxide we are getting uh, boric acid. Second one is properties of boric acid. The first property it reacts with sodium hydroxide to form sodium metaborate and sodium tetraborate. See the reaction NaOH plus H3BO3 it is giving NaBO2 plus 2H2O that is uh, sodium metaborate. Second one is uh, NaOH plus H3BO3 uh, Na2B4O7 plus H2O the next one is action of heat boric acid when heated at 373 Kelvin giving metaboric acid at 413 Kelvin tetraboric acid when heated at red hot it is giving boric anhydride it is a glassy mass see the reaction H3BO3 at 373 that is metaboric acid that is HBO2 then 413 Kelvin it is giving H2B4O7 when it heat at red hot it is giving B2O3 next one is action of ammonia see the reaction fusion of urea with BOH3 in an atmosphere of ammonia at 800 to 1200 Kelvin it is giving boron nitride see the reaction 
when bo boh thrice plus ammonia nh3 when you heat you will get boron nitrate plus h2o okay students we will wind up today's lesson so watch full video and uh, go through the textbook and take notes and update your knowledge thank you students